Hey everyone, welcome to Encore, and today I'm going to show you how you can contour your nose using the Sculpt and Shape Duo. And for those of you guys who doesn't have Sculpt and Shape Duo, you can also use some matte eyeshadows to do this. All you need to do is find a light color for highlighting, and something like a soft brown or like a bronze color for contouring. But make sure it's matte and doesn't have any shimmers or glitters in it. So if everyone's ready, I am. So let's begin. Hey everyone, welcome back. So contouring your nose is actually really easy. And the trick again is lighting. So basically what you want to do is highlight the area that the light's going to hit it first, which is usually right on the top. And then you want to contour the sides because that's what's going to cast the shadow. Now, you can reshape the shape of your nose by narrowing this area right here, especially if you have a, you know, wider, a wider nose. In this part right here, you can definitely give the illusion of a narrower nose by using contouring and some highlighting powder. Now, the new duo just gives you that. It's got the highlighter, which is the light color, and then you have the contouring powder, which is the dark color. Now, as far as brushes are concerned, contouring brushes, just like a 168 or a 169, are too big. All right, so you want something that's narrow enough that you can really put attention to detailing the contouring and the highlighting of your notes as well. So what I found is that the MAC 275, which is actually an eyeshadow brush, and it's angled cut and it's natural bristles, much like a 168, only a mini me version. So you see the, uh, the bristle? And... Um, this actually works just as well for <laughs> contouring your nose. So we're going to work on that. So we're going to start with contouring. So what we're going to do is we're going to darken the side of the nose right here. And we're going to leave the top because that's where the light usually hits it. And what I'm, what I'm going to do actually is I'm going to narrow the top a little bit over here so that, that way it doesn't look, you know, too wide in here so that it'll give me kind of like that little you know, narrow look to the tip of my nose. So, to do that, we're going to start with the contouring, which is the darker of the two. Now I'm using Accentuate and Sculpt Duo, and that's the one that best suits my skin color. I'm just going to apply that right into my brush, and I'm going to start from the eyebrow. And I'm going to darken the side right here. Let's see if I can achieve this and film at the same time. There you go. And then bring that down to the side of the nostril right here, all right, and just bring that in, and then right in the tip of the front right here. Actually, contour that pe that area right there, because you want to darken that. All right. So we're just going to contour that side, almost like, you know putting a line right there. And then what we're going to do is we're going to blend that out. All right. Okay, can you guys see that right there? That's what you want. So you can see it's darker right here up to the tip of my nose, right in the bottom area. And then it's darker right there. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to darken that further so that way the video picks it up more so you, can, so you guys can see it. Okay, and then blend outwards so that way you don't have the line right here and it just blends nicely right there. Okay, so once you do that, do the other side. So start from the eyebrow, right into the side of the nose, and then create that line all the way to the side of the nostril right here, and then bring that to the front. 
right there. Okay. And then blend it out towards the cheek so that way you don't have a line right here and it just looks nice and natural looking. And then bring it right in the side of the nose right here. Okay, can you guys see that? That shadow right there? Alright, so what I'm going to do is I want to narrow this a little bit more. So I'm just going to add a little bit more. I'm just going to darken it a little bit right in the tip over here. Okay. Now, this area right here shouldn't be any wider than your pinky finger, okay? So just kind of like mark it with your pinky finger, just like that. And just make sure the two sides are even. And again, make sure it's very well blended out. So that way it looks natural and it doesn't look like, you know, he have a sharp line and edges right there. Okay, so just blend that nicely. All right, great. So now we're going to move on to the highlighting powder, which is the light color. I'm going to use the same brush. I'm just going to wipe it a little bit to get most of the dark color out. And then we're going to pick up the uh, light color, and this one's Accentuate. And what we're going to do is we're going to apply that right on the top and the bridge of the nose. And then right here between the eyebrows, and then just blend that up and out towards the forehead. Can you guys see that? All right. So once you apply that, next thing you're going to do is you're going to want to make sure there's no sharp lines in between. So what you want to do is just softly brush that out a little bit towards the contouring color. Okay, just like that, so that you can get rid of that sharp line, so that, that way it looks more blended. All right. And then what you want to do is, this is one thing that people forget when they're contouring their noses, are the nostrils right here. The light's going to hit that first. So you just want to touch that a little bit with the highlighting powder. See that? Just like so, and then wipe your brush again, and what you want to do is then from the eyebrow, you just kind of want to dust and sweep the excess powder. And then blend it out. And just very lightly, because again, you don't want to create a sharp edge once again. And there you have it. Now you have a contoured nose, and it's narrower looking. And there you, ha there, there you have it. So, I hope this works out for you guys. Ooh, look at that. Hmm? <laughs> so until next time, thanks for joining me, guys. See you guys soon. Bye.